Entrepreneur George Go is confident he will qualify as a presidential candidate, given Singaporeans, uh, giving Singaporeans a chance to vote in the upcoming election. Now, he spoke to reporters in English, Mandarin and Malay this morning when he was at the Elections Department to collect the required forms. Lauren Ong reports. Presidential hopeful George Goh says he's coming forward so that Singaporeans can have a chance to vote. Good morning. Good morning. He says his decision to run has been years in the making. He said guidance from a team of professionals since 2017 when the criteria for private sector candidates was tightened. And he's confident that he can meet all the requirements to run in the race. I think we must give the people a chance to vote. Uh, you look at the last five election, presidential elections, three walk over. I think the people reserve it to vote for the president. Prospective candidates from the private sector must have headed a profitable company with at least 500 million in shareholders' equity for three years. Mr. Goh says he meets this criteria as he's owned more than 100 companies with a collective market capitalization value of more than 3 billion. Among these, Austria International, which he chairs, is currently on the SGX watch list. The company says it has met the pre-tax profitability requirement. What's left now is its average daily market capitalization. The watch list is talking about the main board. You need to be crossing 40 million. I think now we have 58 million. So there is only one of the company. It's not going to affect my eligibility. As to who meets the criteria, that decision lies with the Presidential Elections Committee. A fellow businessman told CNA why he supports yes. Mr Goh's candidacy. His ability to manage funds. We find listed company under him. I think, um, I think, I think it, there's something to say about him yeah, as a person. So, uh, and on top of that, uh, he has a heart, a heart that is uh, for the people. And he has uh, some plans to actually to take care of the uh, less, for less fortunate people. Mr Goh says he started out poor and has gained a lot from Singapore. So now it's time for him to serve the nation. And he believes what the people need and want is a candidate without political affiliations. Please give an independent a chance. More important, the heart of the person serve the nation. That is the key. It's not about who famous, it doesn't matter at all. Famous cannot translate into the heart of the people, cannot. Famous is individual. Serving is from the heart. Doris Tay, his accountant for over a decade, says Mr. Goh has the qualities that suit a president. A father of four, Mr. Goh says he understands the concerns of young people, which include the high costs of living. Today, we must have someone who can stand together with the young people. We must have someone, it's their voice. He regularly mentors young people and they were present to support him. His tenacity, his adaptability and his flexibility in decision making, I think that, was, that is very important in terms of, you know, perhaps running for the country. Applying for a certificate of eligibility is just the first step for those running for the highest office. The deadline, five days after the Prime Minister, issues the ridge of election.